Good afternoon. Um, I usually don't have a base camp for this because it's not necessary, but I'm lazy and I don't want to take it out. So, <sighs> might as well get closer to my mic because I realize that my mic has a little bit of trouble picking me up sometimes. So let me just, uh, I don't want it to sound bad, but um, it's also a little bit more personal. Um, if you don't know, I use getting over it as a way to talk about specific things that I want to, things that are important to me, topics that are not really easy without having something to auto uh, mend my time or do something to distract myself. And overall, it's a game that's supposed to make you upset or angry because of the failure and whatnot, but I prefer to... Uh, Think of it as a, a test of patience. Something that I lack. I can't even get my thing to work. So I am having um, issues in my personal life. A lot of them. They pile up and pile up and pile up. And it becomes harder and harder to really see any light in, in my life. First try. And... I'll be honest with you, sometimes I, uh, yeah, there's some, I also like some of the quotes that they, uh, show off, Ooh. anyway, um, I have been constantly around a failure in my life, um, not, not me failing, but just something going wrong or something happening that it it's hard to stay motivated when I just expect everything to whether it's my fault or the fault of my situation or things like that I end up wanting to run away from my problems run away from my issues run away from reality itself and I think that's why I, I enjoy or consume media that's um, different than the real world because it's easier for me to fantasize um, a better beginning or a better whatever in a world where the rules aren't the same versus in this one where I already know the rules. I already know how things work and they're not going to work in my favor. Now, I've been very lucky, absolutely lucky with how, um, how well I've been doing lately. And I won't discount that and say that, you know, I'm full of bad luck completely. But I do feel like the majority of my life goes in in forms of uh, a balance, I'll say. That it's not necessarily absolutely bad, but there's always something bad that happens along with every bit of good. And I think that's just what happens naturally. That life is so unpredictable that you can't have all good or all bad. That there's always going to be varyings of good and bad. And... Um, you know, human brains naturally focus on the negative. They always focus on things that um, might hurt us in any kind of way or make it harder for us to survive. Now, in a sense of life or death when it comes to animals attacking us or things like that, it makes sense. But in this abstract world where um, ideas are different than we, we can think... Oh, my thing isn't working. Oh, oh, oh well. I just like to oh, go at it. Just keep going. Try. Oh, oh well. Oops. Now I'm focused. But anyway, I, I I've realized I'm not a great person, and I, I'm trying to be a good person. I'm trying to be. I'm trying to learn and grow better. And that's the scary thing is that people will only ever see uh, how you what you've done and not what you're trying to do they'll only ever see um a glimpse a snapshot of your character and they don't ever see the, the mind behind it how you feel about it i feel now i'll be honest i don't have the ability to feel um complete guilt i'll say i know when things are wrong and i know when i do wrong but i don't get any kind of guttural feeling or any kind of uh, emotional feeling towards feeling guilt. 
I, I it just it's an empty and mo like most things it's just an empty blank spot when I think of things that I've done I just don't have this regret in my heart which I should and I really should but it just I only I rationalize that's that's how I know what I do should be better and maybe maybe subconsciously I am able to feel guilt to a degree I am able to feel something and it's just my brain's way of coping with um, any kind of complex emotion that isn't like if it goes too far in one direction I just you know dip out I just pretend that I'm emotionless or something I don't know but sometimes I feel like um, my brain decides to over exaggerate how little I feel sometimes it's this permanent apathy that I can't get rid of I can only feel in extremes I have so many anger issues um, because of all the bullying and rumors and crap that's happened to me you know people were always just awful to me my entire life the level of just and and many bad experiences that nobody should ever have to go through ever but oh, oh, uh oh uh oh but we persevere my mouse is not working the way I want it to that's okay bah bah so this is not going to be entertaining it's not going to be something that is worthwhile watching unless you're interested in how the, the deeper parts of me and my life. I, I view, I think of, I think this is an important thing for me to do, however, because if I do have any pull with anybody, if I do have any influence with people, if people do see my things and it causes them to think and want to be better, I think that's important that I should try to do that. Don't worry. Ugh. This doesn't doesn't want to listen. Oh. No. 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 Just stay up. That's not what I'm doing. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh God, sorry, I just completely forgot myself. Anyway. People are full of mistakes, or rather they're full of bad choices that they've made. And I'm so young, I am obviously gonna make so It doesn't excuse the mistakes I've, make, I've made, but uh, they do play, but it, it, it does play a very big part in why those mistakes are made. I can only know so much at any given time. Oh, so close. Hold on, I almost got excited. Almost, almost. Oh, <laughs> almost. Almost, uh, persevere, persevere, ah, persevere, dang, uh, uh, uh. oh, it's, it's so annoying because the hammer isn't fast enough, like, my movements are being tracked, it, this would be a lot easier if I could do like that, like, it just doesn't. Uh. All right. Oh. <sighs> Whatever. So I use this series, this getting over it thing, to help my mind, help distract me from. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> 
You telling me that you can kill it? <laughs> oh, I don't need help distracting myself, Jesus. <laughs> oh, okay, calm down. No, fast or nothing. Fast or nothing. <sighs> exactly. Persevere. Oops. Oops. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, <laughs> that's how I always feel whenever I miss the thing. It's like... <laughs> like I'm making a jump. <laughs> like I'm jumping from a platform and I just jump backwards. <laughs> oh, you probably don't get what I mean. Oh, his ass must be pretty as hell being in this thing of water. Oh, yeah, I got it. <sighs> Dang it. No. Oh. No, 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 no. <laughs> All right, anyway. Uh, I'll be honest. I. Oh. Most arcs were mostly harmless. And after the Kid, we're hoping to all be. Ah. William Shakespeare, all fell away. Oh. Oh. Oh well. All right, jeez, shush. I'm trying to talk, sir. Your pain would not seem less harmless if I could only feel it. If I only could. Look at Blue. My pain would seem less wondrous than my joy. Pain and joy are two different things, you fool. I don't want pain. Pain. I'm tired of people saying that life um, could not wouldn't be interesting without pain. Like, okay, not maybe not. Like, sure. Wife wouldn't be absolute without somewhat of pain, like just simple annoyances and things like that, because our brains are wired to accept that. But like, absolute pain? Get out of here. Get out of here. Come on. You tell him, like, boredom? Fine. I can understand life being different if you were content all the time. There's like nothing you wanted to aspire for, there's nothing you wanted to do. But like, Feeling like crap all the time? Get out of here. It's life, bro. It's life. That's just how life is. It doesn't have to be. That's how life is because that's what we have been forced to accept. Ah, oh, dang. I mean, morally, you should want... Ooh, thought. Whoa, you thought. You thought you could do that. Be gone, thought. Come on, stretch. You're not even stretching your arms out. Look at you. Look at you. Oh. Oh, damn it. Ah. Slow and steady wins the race. Okay, anyway. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> You might sleep in the floor. Sure, Mom. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh. Stop. Okay, anyway. Bottom line is, is that change is a continuous thing. And it's not immediate. You can realize and rationalize about Like me, personally, I always am able to see when I have something that's problematic or something that I'm doing that I should not be doing. I'm able to pinpoint and say, whoa, you're right, that's bad. Um, if I yell at somebody, if I'm acting a certain way, I truly try to change myself because I want to be as kind of a human being as I could possibly can. And that anger is in the way of that. But, um, what was I saying? 
What was the thing? I'm, I'm able to write. I'm able to see it. But it's one thing to see it and to actually, you know, actively change it. And I am trying to actively change it. I'm trying to... I can't control how I will always feel about everything. Come on. Who cares? Yes. Yes. Perseverance. Vindication. Oh. I guess I could end this video right here. I've said everything. I, I don't care to say much else. I just was in a mood and wanted to say something. It's also late, so I shouldn't be too loud. But, um, you could, uh, oh my god, I can't believe I'm about to say this, but uh, I don't care. I'm about, I need it as much as possible. Like, comment, and subscribe, because I am... 82 away from being able to be partnered. 82. Oh, I need a certain amount of watch time, but I can get that. Just just follow. We can figure it out later. Just give me a thousand followers and we'll be golden. 186 maybe. I don't know. I don't know. But maybe tomorrow I'll make a better video on this. Maybe weeks from now. But I don't know. Y'all have a wonderful day. And even though life is hard and terrible all the time, it doesn't have to be forever. Patience. Wait. Don't worry. I mean, you can't control it sometimes. Mental illness is a thing. And sometimes emotions are just hard to regulate. But things always work out. That's the philosophy I like to think. It helps me think. It helps me be happy. As long as I think, don't worry, something good will happen. I might make it tomorrow. Till tomorrow. Have a wonderful night, guys. I love you.